So I've gotten a little deeper into it here. Um, so as I showed, brake line is connected up there, removed and out of the way, so we're not stretching it. The other thing you wanna do is, uh, this is the ABS sensor on the rear. Um, I had a scare that I damaged on the front doing this already. So um, this just, it's a 10 mil right there, goes through there, boom, that plugs into down. Um, as I'm dropping this rear axle, as you can see that I've got the mounts out there. Um, you don't want to stress that either. So just disconnect all the stuff uh, so you're not yanking on those wires. This is the e-brake line. Um, it's a lot more robust, so I'm not too worried about that. And I've just got the whole axle here, as you can tell, I've got it suspended with the jack on this side. An old tire that I took from my neighbor's shop. It's sitting there supporting the main part of the axle. And same on the other side, I've got some two by fours. But here's the uh, pivot point for the rear axle. So the goal here is we're actually trying to lower this down. Um, you can see on the other side there too, it's dropped out of the car. So the rear axle is completely detached from the car now. Uh, I'm gonna try and put my mounts in and see how those work. Um, and they're gonna fit right up in there and lower the mounting point down to about here.